For the first time in history, the X-37B Mini Shuttle belonging to the United States military will be launched via SpaceX Falcon Heavy. According to a recent news release from the Pentagon, the experimental space plane of the United States military is set to launch into orbit for the first time using a SpaceX Falcon Heavy rocket. The X-37B spacecraft will take off from NASA's Kennedy Space Center with the earliest possible launch date being December 7th. The X-37B orbital test vehicle is set to embark on its seventh flight with the upcoming Falcon Heavy launch. This mini shuttle is managed by the Department of the Air Force Rapid Capabilities Office in collaboration with the United States Space Force. Formerly known as USS F-52, this mission is ready to take off. In a statement, Lieutenant Colonel Joseph Fritchen, the X-37B program director, expressed his enthusiasm for the improved capabilities of the reusable X-37B. The flight-proven service module and Falcon Heavy rocket will be utilized to conduct numerous state-of-the-art experiments for the Department of the Air Force and its collaborators. According to the press release, the mission will involve the space plane operating in novel orbital spheres, but no particular information was given. Previous missions conducted with the X-37B have taken place in low Earth orbit. The space plane has been specifically crafted for extended stays in orbit, intended for a vast array of Space Force and NASA experiments and tests. The forthcoming OTV-7 mission will incorporate a radiation experiment known as SEEDS-2, which will investigate the effects of prolonged spaceflight radiation on multiple types of plant seeds. The forthcoming flight will also be testing out technologies that could potentially be used in the future to improve space domain awareness. This testing is being done with the goal of creating a safe, stable and secure environment in space for all those who utilize it. The upcoming launch of the X-37B on a Falcon Heavy rocket, designated as OTV-7, will be the initial instance of such a launch. In contrast, the fifth spaceflight of the space plane occurred on September 7, 2017, and was launched on a Falcon 9 Block 4 rocket. The previous four launches of the space plane utilized a ULA Atlas V in order to achieve orbit. The duration of the upcoming flight of the X-37B remains undisclosed. However, it is noteworthy that each previous mission of the X-37B has been progressively lengthier. The latest mission was launched on May 17, 2020, and concluded on November 12, 2022, having touched down at Space Florida's launch and landing facility located at KSC. The initial mission to include a service module affixed to the back of the space plane marked a significant milestone. This addition enabled the inclusion of additional experiments on board. One of these experiments was a seed experiment for NASA, and the other was the Falcon Sat 8, a satellite that was built and is still being operated by cadets from the US Air Force Academy and remains in orbit. The X-37B program has two space planes in its fleet, although it has not been revealed which one is slated to launch during the upcoming mission. This undertaking serves to reinforce the existing partnership between the United States Space Force and SpaceX in order to substantiate and improve upon the latter's capacity for launching payloads into space. The fifth flight of Falcon Heaviside boosters B-1064 and B-1065 will take place during this upcoming mission. These boosters were initially utilized during USS F-44's launch, which occurred on November 1st, 2022. Following this, they were employed on missions such as USS F-67, Jupiter-3 Echo Star-24, and NASA's Psyche missions. As per the US Space Systems Command, the launch agreement with SpaceX for this mission holds a value of $154,726,072. In October of 2024, SpaceX and NASA intend to utilize the side boosters for the final time to bolster the Europa Clipper mission, which will dispatch a spacecraft to examine one of Jupiter's moons. The Falcon Heavy will be operating at full capacity during this launch, requiring the complete expenditure of both the side boosters and the core stage. To support our channel's growth and ensure broader awareness, kindly hit the like and subscribe buttons. This will help us reach more individuals and disseminate valuable information. Thank you in advance.